Hey everyone, what's up? It's Jonathan here with Infinite Potential Media and today we are going to be looking at the brand new New Mutants trailer. Now Fox have done pretty well here, I mean I had no idea this was coming out, I took a bathroom break at work, saw everything blowing up on my phone and thought, okay this is the perfect opportunity to do a trailer reaction. So I just told my friend Glenn, like, look the New Mutants trailers out because he loves X-Men and he said, oh sorry I'm watching this straight away. So I was left in the dark, he basically told me that, he kept it very vague, which I was very grateful for, um, he told me that it was a very, very different feel towards this film, um, it doesn't show that much, which, thank god, let's hope it keeps that way, because that's what they did with Deadpool, and we got some nice little surprises here and there, um, he said it was very, had a lot of horror tones in it, which I'm, I'm interested in seeing, I mean, Fox, I feel, are going through this very weird change at the moment where they're moving away from the classic superhero genre, which I am not too bothered about indeed, but um, I feel like they know what their target audience is now, which is extremely important, important which is extremely important for them um, commercially because, I mean, they've got to make uh, bacon at the end of the day. So, yeah, I don't know anything about New Mutants which, um, once again, Glenn, my friend, was very disgusted with. So, without further ado, let's just uh, watch this bad boy and see what it's all about. Uh, I don't know if I'm allowed. Okay. There we go. I'm gonna ask you a series of questions. Does Blade Runner? I want you to respond truthfully. Have you ever hurt someone? No. Yes. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Have you ever experienced anything you'd consider abnormal? <sighs> it's gonna be chills. Yes. Last question. Do you know what mutants are? Ooh. Did you know baby rattlesnakes are more dangerous than adult ones? They haven't learned how to control how much venom they secrete. Ah! All of you are dangerous. Hey! That's why you're here. Upside down. Okay. What is this place? This is a hospital. That's a haunted house. Right, okay, so you can see that they're going for a very specific vibe there. Um, felt a lot like Stranger Things, which is ironic because, as I mentioned earlier when I watched the trailer, it's one of the cast members! Uh, I'm not quite sure what the actor's name is, which I feel really guilty about. Um, but you know what? It's very vague and it looks very interesting. Um, like I said, I'm going to need to familiarise myself with the comics because um, New Mutants was one of the ones that I definitely missed out on growing up. Uh, I'm trying to think. It's, it was just a really vague trailer. At the beginning, with the visuals that we were getting, um, it reminded me a lot of American Horror Story Asylum, which I absolutely loved. It's one probably my favourite series of American Horror Story. Um, it has a very, very... I'm not too sure... Yeah, it's, it has a very made-for-TV feel, if you know what I mean. Not in a bad way, in a sense that we've got this 16 by 9 aspect ratio, which um, is very rare for films, unless they're shot on iMac cameras. Um, and it's very different to what Fox have been doing so far, but hey, if the 
this is going to be the way that they're doing things with differentiation in the visuals and story, then I'm all for it. I know that Gambit's coming out next year. No, 2019. They've just announced a new release date, so maybe they've finally cracked the code. Who knows? But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this reaction, and if you did, don't forget to like this video, comment below, tell me your thoughts on the trailer, and obviously, don't forget to subscribe.